Okay, students. Good morning. Today we will do some questions from class nine, computer mathematics. Math brings two thousand two hundred eighty page one hundred forty nine. Rectangular room. Area floor, area of walls, volume. Not a certain area. Now let's start from question number seven a. Seven eight. The area of floor of the cubicle room is forty nine meter square. Find the area of four walls of the room. In a cubicle cubicle room, area of floor area of floor a equal to forty nine meter square. We need to find area of four walls. Now, area four walls in cubic room equal to four times of area of floor. Four times of forty-nine. Eight gram. Four times of forty-nine. One hundred ninety-six. Meter square. Now, question number seven B. On seven B in a cubic column, area of four walls is hundred. Find the area of floor. Now, if solution here in a cubic column, area of four walls, area of four walls. Students, we go to question number eight. A. Now on eight A, we have the area of the square room of height five meter is thirty six meter square. Find the area of its four walls. In a square room. Height as is equal to five meter. Height as is five meter. Area a equal to thirty six meter square. Area of four walls equal to question mark. Now in this square room a equal to area of this square room a equal to this square or Thirty six is called area square. Therefore, area equal to six meter. Then <coughs> area of four walls. Area of four walls equal to this square. Area of four walls equal to four l l. Four times of six times of five. This is equal to one hundred twenty meter square. So the area of four walls is one hundred twenty meter square. Now, students, we go to eight B. On eight B, we have remember that if the area of four walls It is eighty meter square in this square room. Height four meter. Calculate the area of floor in this square room. Area of four walls equal to eighty meter square. Height that's equal to four meter. 
Any app or you can go to my now. Any app or was you can do four m yes. Or eighty you can do four into l into s is four. Therefore, length is five meter. Then area of road in square root of the L square. So five square thirty five meter square. Now you go to question number nine A. <coughs> In a rectangular room, in a rectangular room, perimeter is thirty-two meter, height is eight meter. Perimeter T equal to thirty-two meter. Thirty-two equal to Two times L plus B equal to thirty two meter. In a kilo room, perimeter is two times of L plus B. I yes equal to eight meter. Area of four walls. Area of four walls equal to question mark. Now area of four walls in a rectangle room. That is two S L plus B. This equal to two L plus B into L. What two L plus B is? That is thirty two. And height is eight. Now so that equal to thirty two times of eight becomes two hundred fifty six meters. So it is area of walls. Now today we go to nine B. So nine B. So nine B we have area of walls is one hundred sixty eight. In the rectangular room, area of walls is one hundred sixty eight meters square. And height of room, height of room is equal to two meter. So we need to find perimeter room. Perimeter of room equal to question mark. Now we know that area of four walls in a rectangular room equal to two as L plus B, or that is given as one hundred sixty-eight equal to two times L plus B into S, or one hundred sixty-eight equal to two times L plus B, that is perimeter T, and I did given as four. Therefore, perimeter T equal to Forty-two meter. So the perimeter is forty-two meter. Now we go to question number ten. A. Three 
72 meter square. <coughs> width of carpet. Width of carpet. B equal to 2.4 meter. Length of carpet. Now we know that area of floor equal to length of carpet into width of carpet. Or oh, area is given as 72, length of carpet is 72, fine, breadth or width of carpet is 2.4. Or oh, L equal to 72 divided by 2.4. Therefore, length of carpet equal to 30 meter. So the required length of carpet is 30 meter. Now we go to question number 10 B. In a square room 10 B in a square room Area of floor is 81. Area of floor is 81 meter square. If the width of carpet is 2.7, width of carpet breadth is 2.7, find the length. So, area of square room is equal to length of carpet into breadth of carpet. So, 81 is equal to length of carpet. Of the breadth of carpet is 2.7. Therefore, L equal to 81 divided by 2.7. Now, we know it becomes 30 meters. So, length of carpet is 30 meters. Now, we go to the next question. Question number 11. A. and ceiling of a room is 107 meters square. If the room is 6 meters long, find the width and find the height of the room. Solution here. In a rectangular room. In a rectangular room. There are four walls and ceiling. There are four walls and ceiling equal to 107 meters square. <coughs> Length of room. Length L equal to 6 meters. Width breadth B equal to 5 meter height. That's equal to question mark. Now, we know that area of four walls and ceiling equal to two years L plus B plus L into B. Area of four walls, two years L plus B, and area of floor, ceiling, area of ceiling is L into B. Area of ceiling is equal to area of floor, that is same. Or, this is given as 107 equal to 2 years, then 6 plus breadth 5. L into B is 6 into 5. Or 107 equal to 6 plus 5, 11, you got 22 years, plus 6, 5, you got 30. Or 107 minus 30 equal to 22 years. Or this is equal to 7, 107 minus 30. That is 107 minus 30, that is 76. 
7 because the current is this thing is one divided by 32 so it gives 3.5 therefore height is value 3.5 meters so the height is 3.5 meters now we go to design B the question is already big. The area of walls and ceiling of a room is 418. 418 meter square. Length is 6 meter. And height is 4 meter. We have to find the length. Height is 4 meter. So we need to find the length. The area of walls and ceiling go to L plus A plus L into B. Now, <coughs> area of walls plus ceiling. This is 118. So we shall do this. Then two heads. High is four. Two types of four. And L plus B. Length is six. Breath is seven. Fine. And here L into B. Breath is B. Or 118 equal to 4 to the 8 times 6 plus B plus 6 into B 6B. Or 118 equal to 8 6 to the 48 plus 8 times of B 8B plus 6B. Or 118 minus 48 equal to 8 plus 6. 14. Now 118 minus 48, it becomes 70. Or 70 equal to 14, B. therefore, B equal to 5 meters. So the width is 5 meter. Okay, students, this was for today. Have a nice time. See you soon.